Hi, this is Ethan from Printed Village, and today I'm going to show you guys how to draw some basic ropes to help out with your nautical patterns. Alright, so to get started, I'm going to make a new layer, and I'm going to grab the brush tool, and then making sure that you use black, zoom out a little, I'm just going to draw a little C shape, like that. Once you've got that done, go over and grab the marquee tool, Put a rectangle around it, then go up to Edit and Define Brush Preset. So click on that, and then click OK. We don't need that anymore. So now we're going to switch over and we're going to use the Pen tool on the side. And it's going to drag out a little squiggly line for our rope. It can, it can be whatever shape you want it to be. I'm going to make mine do a little loop like this. There we go. And once you've got that, you're going to get the brush again. And using the hard round brush, select the color that you want for the background of your rope. And then adjust the size until it looks like the width you want. That looks about right. And then in the layer menu, you'll notice there are three tabs on the top. You're going to want to click the far right one that says Paths. And making sure that you have the path you just made selected, you're going to click this little open circle down in the bottom, which will put the brush stroke along the path you just made. Like that. So now we're going to go back to the brushes menu. And we're going to select the custom brush that we just made. I think I see it right here. And there are a couple things I need to change about this so that it'll look like a rope. First thing is we want to adjust the spacing out a little bit, maybe around 70 or 80 percent. Actually, yeah, I think that looks pretty good. And now in the tab under that called Shape Dynamics, <clears throat> you want to make sure that the size jitter is set to off the angle jitter is set to direction, and the roundness jitter is set to off. And once you've got all that, you want to do the same thing. Get the brush to be the right size for your rope, and select the color that you want for the, the thread of the rope, and then click the little circle icon. And there you have it. There's a really basic drawing of a rope, and you can go back in and clean this up. You can also adjust the path to change the shape of it. So I hope this helps you out with your nautical prints. Have fun. Bye.